Welcome. This episode shows you how to easily clean and efficiently maintain your outdoor fountain. Step one is start by cleaning out all of the contaminated and dirty water. To properly do this job, you'll need a strong gasoline or an electric blower. We prefer this 20 volt DeWalt leaf blower. Possibly a scrub brush, a clean water supply or garden hose, and this algae clarifier that we purchased from Amazon Prime, which does a very good job. My wife and I have been away from our house on vacation out of town for the past week and a half. As you can see, most of the water in our fountain has evaporated and algae has set in. The water is also loaded with bird poop. Basically, the fountain is in need of a thorough cleaning to include cleaning the pump area, which I'll show you in a minute. Next, we'll replenish the fountain with new water and add clarifier to it. If we keep the fountain full and add clarifier to it on a weekly basis, we can go approximately one month before having to thoroughly clean the fountain again. At this time, I'm going to show you how effectively our DeWalt blower removes the dirty water and debris from the fountain. Okay, so at this time here, I'm going to remove the access door to the dirty pump area, as I mentioned earlier. Okay, I'm putting the finishing touches on the filling the fountain again when we have it filled. And as you can see, we're in good shape. So at this time, we'll add the clarifier to the water within the fountain per the manufacturer's instructions on the back. So as you can see, we've, our fountain is full, water is clean, and we're in good shape with the, the refill with the clarifier that'll keep this clear for the next two, three weeks, up to a, up to a month. And you know, once again, we'll, we'll clean it again. This concludes my demonstration on how to easily clean and officially maintain your outdoor fountain. At this time, I'm moving on to my next project. 
You're more than welcome to follow. In addition, if you have a great project that you want to post on my YouTube channel, email me some pictures and a brief description of it. If it qualifies for the Let's Fix It Right standards to help others, I'll interview you over the phone as a guest do-it-yourselfer, produce a high-quality video, and post it on my Let's Fix It Right channel. For the year following this posting, I'll share 50% of the potential YouTube benefits with you. If you have any subject matter requests or recommendations, please contact me. All of this said, I recommend that you subscribe to my channel, follow my projects, and save a bundle of money doing it.